look at the series between these two teams, which has gone Iowa State's way all the way. Last year they won at Lehigh. And also, we want to show you the uh, matchups tonight. You can see up on the fancy scoreboard here, up above the uh, center of the mat, what uh, that can do with a lot of the names. At 118 pounds, the first of the Knight brothers for Iowa State, Dan Knight against Ed Regan. At 126, Knight against Clavel, Steve Knight. Jeff Gibbons is back tonight against Buzz Mirrors, another freshman. Murray Anderson wrestles senior Jim Frick at 142. Gezi is uh, another 42 pounder is not there. Krieger, national champion against Chad Watkins at 160. He made it count. Now you get to see a senior for Lehigh, Chad Watkins, another Blair Academy man, up against, however, the national champion. Tim Krieger's been out for a little while with an injury, and he's just getting to settle back into shape again. But he hasn't lost a match in two years. I think we'll probably see a more calm Tim Krieger. He's uh, probably had to adjust his style a little bit due to uh, injuries. And well, he's one of the best uh, young wrestlers in the country. There's no getting around it. Offense, guys, let's go. And Watkins knows it. Nice pick, but he didn't score. Got to control it. No point there. Watkins took a shot, but now uh, back in the middle now. Krieger got head and arm control from the front. Front headlock. Watkins is a senior from Ocean, New Jersey. Talk about a serious look on the mat. Tim Krieger is pretty intimidating sometimes when he's out on the mat. He's very serious on the nope. uh, very serious look and. He's out there for one purpose, and I think the other wrestler pretty much knows what it is, and he better be ready to go. Now he took the head right away, and two. that's two at a big hurt. One. Krieger is up two to one after letting his man go. 140 now, 140. 140, baby. We've used only about a minute and a half here in the first period. Krieger of Iowa State on the left. See him going, looks like a, uh, it's not quite a fireman's carry, it's an outside carry. And he's not, you, you don't see him going down to his knees as much. Something I haven't seen him do before. There's a pick, nice cross pick there. He's intimidated because he can come at you in so many ways. And he stayed with him there. Heel pick yeah. that time makes it four to one. Right here, he snaps the head, and that all came off a, uh, a head snap right there. He controlled the head, dropped his level, came across on the heel pick, two points. Now he lets Watkins go. You're at 150 pounds. Well, that was a good example of setups. The setups are so, so important in wrestling. You don't just go in and shoot a double or shoot a single off no setup. And there's various types, and right there, and again, here he is setting up his position by controlling the head and he's looking for the leg attack. Lehigh is worn, Lehigh is worn. I think it's, uh, it's easy to get a little swarm, you know, when you're up against somebody like Krieger because uh, Step in. anything you do might be disaster. Now Krieger's working two on one, comes down to the low level, goes to the other side now. Right now he goes to the body lock. Body lock. Oh. Oh, we're both up. That's the worst of all fates right there. Getting taken down with the leg is not so bad as being pinned from your feet. Looked like uh, Tim Trigger grimaced a little bit. Yeah, I did. On his knee. How will this resolve? Trigger decides just to let him go and turn around and take him down. Six two, and here's where he really gets tough. This is the tilt. He got two back points. Eight to two now. Tim Krieger is so tough on the mat. Remember, at the end of this match, we're going to have the our seven basic skills of wrestling with Chuck Patton tonight. First in a series of wrestling fundamentals with Chuck. Coming up right after this match at 150 pounds. 
Iowa State leads in the meet 13 to 3 after four matches. Krieger is leading by here. six here. He's got the body lock. Two. Uh, two. Two. Watkins came out of that better than it could have been. Too bad. Take down with a throw, a near fall. Again, here he comes for the two or three two, points in the back. Three. Does a good job of elevating those hips. Well, it's 14 to two now. He can make this a technical fall very fast. One, both up. 14 to two. Fourteen to three after the let up. <laughs> Watkins wouldn't throw that time. He's fairly strong. He's got some strength. What a man! Just pulled somebody's arm out of his socket. That hurt, and it's sixteen to three. Place is buzzing after that one. We'll just see what happened here. Let's, let's take let's a look here. Again. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. He just, okay, he's dragging by, a little short drag by, and he just basically pulled that. Yeah, but you don't usually drag the no, whole man no. by. No, oh, I'd say hold it too if I was the Lehigh wrestler. Well, uh, Tim Krieger ranked first at 150, as you might expect. He's only two points away from a technical fall here, and I'm sure the coaches discussed that. What does he want to do? You want to hang around and try to pin him, or do you want to go for the technical fall? Boy, I'll tell you. I think uh, maybe you just got your answer. That's it. You know, you said... Tim, you said at the top, at the, at the beginning here, that you thought maybe Krieger would come back better than ever. Well, you know, he really did show a variety of attack there, and I think that's what you're going to see this year, because once you get injured and you have the talent that you have, like Tim Krieger has, you have to get smart. You have to realize that you're going to have to work around your injury. Well, in Tim Krieger's case, he's so talented that working around your injury means developing a whole new repertoire of moves. <laughs> it's amazing. And once again, now the score here after the fall is with six points for Iowa State is 19 to three at the intermission.